Welcome back, everybody, to Beyond Good and Evil, and uh, we have just now reunited with uh, Double H, and uh, we are just going to be separating briefly here, because uh, uh, this is actually kind of a micro puzzle, and the puzzle, oh, what's in here? Nothing I can use. Awesome. Is basically how the heck do you get around this gate? Because the enemy you would normally use is on the other side of it. Well, Double H provides you a nice little clue, and he's like, there's a vent up there. In the words of Ripley, why is it always Vince? Who's Ripley? Oh, from Aliens. Oh. It's Who's a, Vince? Oh, it's a, it's a common theme in in the movies, uh, the Alien movies, where you, they're always traveling through vent ducts and stuff. Oh. I thought Vince was like a name like Vince. No. I won't Not move Vince. from here. And so we got to do some acrobatics and some teamwork here, because Double H isn't as acrobatic as Jade is, so... He's regulated to button pushing. And so we actually use this. You know, a lot of guys are button pushers. Uh, so are a lot of women. No comment. <laughs> now we push the buttons of those we love just to annoy them. Well, here we are in ventilation, which the sole purpose of this area, besides home to the bubonic plague here, is uh, for a single picture. Okay, and I have absolutely no idea what this thing is. And I. I highly doubt it's an actual real animal. Ignis Infer okay, Ignifera. Good luck for the rest. It just means fire. Yeah. I think it's a firefish. I guess. I don't think that's even a real... Anything based on anything real. It could be. It could be, but I, I doubt it. But if, if it is, just someone drop a comment and maybe a link to where an actual creature like that actually exists in this world. But other than that, I'll just continue to believe that it's make-believe. Okay. By the end of this video game, we will have made star ghosts and given the recipe that we found on the internet. Oh yes, that'll probably be in the last couple of videos. We'll just pop up a recipe image or whatnot. But yay, there we go. I know, I wish I was acrobatic like Jade. That took a lot of jumping and, and outside-the-box thinking, as in going up on a moving uh, port porticulus. I think that's the proper way to pronounce that. Oh, and here's a new portion of a drone. It's the same enemy, but they now start using shields. So you gotta, you gotta hit them while they're firing at you. So it's kind of a little tricky now to knock those robots out of commission. So are we going back for Double H, or is he just yeah. gonna follow us? Nope, we gotta go back for him because he probably doesn't realize we're <laughs> we've cleared the way. Up oh, now he sees us. If you can go through the door, go around it. Everything about Carlson Carlson and Peters. Peters. I think there was a... I don't know if it was a rumor or if it was a real, uh, real uh, in-game trivia fact, but I think uh, he... I think Double H goes off of a children's book, rule book, Carlson and Peters. Um, I'm not really sure if that's true or not, but <laughs> that would be kind of funny. A children's rule book. Yep, Carlson and Peters rule book. <laughs> I think that's an in-universe thing, though. Yes, sir. All right. Oh, we've attracted the attention of someone. Let's see here. Oh, yep, a guard. This is what I don't get. This, these guards are really... I hate to say it, but they're really dumb. I mean, he doesn't even bother to check around the corner. He just... Yeah. Nobody there. Either that or he's just lazy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not even sure they get paid by the doms. And here is a new... Well, there was a new picture, and Double H are totally in the way. And you gotta flick a disc and quick... Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Okay, whew. You gotta be quick shooting that thing. Transmission received. No, that I'll file it right away. Real. Yeah, I would imagine so. Timoria... Yeah, I don't even want to pronounce that thing. Timoria? I'm not sure what the other part said. Something made up. <laughs> oh, Alright, looks like, okay, so we'll both be traveling to the next area. I wasn't sure if it was like that elevator in Neutropol's horrible page had to stay behind and, 
and use the, and I had to use the elevator without him, but looks like we're going together. Uh, more cape ups I can't use. Whoa! I think that's something I can take a picture of. So, Double H, come on power over here. I don't care about the power. Hit the switch. Thank you, Double H. Woohoo! Nice amoeba sultan. I don't really know what sultan stands for, but. Well, I think there's real things as amoebas. Right? Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh whoa, some of the basic forms of life. Basic, I, I should say, cell structure forms of life. But, oh my goodness. Whew. <laughs> That thing was pretty close. Alright, and here's another little micro puzzle, although it's pretty simple in execution here. We have a triangle key! Wait, what? We already got one! Well, why, yes we do. Now we have two triangle keys. So what could that mean? Well, if we walk over here, there is... Oh. <laughs> I got the camera stuck. But the... I know, I, I'm finding all sorts of camera bugs in this game. But, uh, yep, we give the second key to Double H. For opening this door, because there's a switch on either side. If the camera would cooperate... Oh, here we go, it's fixing itself. That is so odd. Yeah, but there were two triangle keys, switches, and you, there was no way you could have gone to each one. And here's where Double H in his impenetrable suit of armor with lasers comes in really handy. He's not even wearing the hat. So, my question is, is his brain full of fluff because he's not wearing the hat because okay. Is that no, why he's having not, trouble recovering from? Yeah, no, no, I'm just wondering. I'm really no, I'm serious. I'm, I'm just wondering. I don't know. Maybe that contributes to some of his goofiness. Is he just goes through lasers without his helmet on? Oh my goodness! It just went right through his head. What do you do? Go back. Go back. I swear he's hurting himself going back and forth between those things. He's got brain damage. I swear. All right, and here we have uh, up, yep, our first photo opportunity, and two guards. I guess you're, if you want to be sneaky about it, you can go up between the guards, take a picture, and then leave. But I want to know what's in those cabinets, so we're gonna do something a little more daring. All right, let's see. Double H and I got to attack as one, and go! Oh yeah, that was teamwork. Oh, so satisfying. Ooh, a boost. I can use boosts. Close it. And another boost. What do the boosts do? Oh, they increase speed for your your hovercraft for a little mo for a brief moment. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh my goodness! Tortured humans going up through a pipe, being electrocuted the whole time. How terrible! Well, we got one picture. Which is kind of funny, this is the first picture you would normally come across in the game, yet it's the third one on the list that when it shows up. Funny that. Like it wasn't supposed to be the first, first picture you would have taken, but it's the first area you would have normally gone to. Okay, and with that I think we're actually done with this particular section of the slaughterhouse. You can... You can almost divide the slaughterhouse up into three areas. Uh, you have you have this area. Uh, I don't even know what uh, this is. Um, but then you have the I think the mind north. Or whatever for all the puzzles. Yeah. Then you have the north wing, and then I think you have the south wing, and they're further in the slaughterhouse. But uh, each major area has a different picture to take. And I think what's weird about this dungeon is that there isn't a boss. I mean, you take your three pictures, and then you leave, and you're done. I think it was weird for me the first time to actually get out of the slaughterhouse after completing all my objectives, and and then, and then there's... Did you go back and try and look for a boss or something? No, I mean, I, I, I looked at the map, and there was nothing, nowhere else left to go, and I was like, all right, well, I guess it's time to go, and then I'm back at the lighthouse, and I'm like, well, I guess it is over. <laughs> Uh, there. Ooh, some drones. 
don't want to get in their searchlights, although I don't know if that guy has a searchlight, but that one does. Skirt the wall. Ooh, a metal box. This must be important. And it is! I must shoot it into one of these. I was aiming for the left, but I'll take... I mean, I was aiming for the right, but I'll take the left one. Oh, gosh. Oh, you are kidding me. That is... Okay, this is nuts. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my... Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, oh gosh. Okay. Uh, oh. Uh, wait. Oh! Oh my goodness, they actually drag you in. They have a slight little pull there. <laughs> if you get too close, they actually start dragging you in. That's kind of... That's that's a little unnerving. Okay. I, I'm not even going to bother shooting at this point. I'm, I'm, I, I'm too steady, focused. Steady. steady. Oh! Ah, Alright, good. We're done. Whew! I was gonna get another death there. <laughs> Look at all that smoke. We're yeah, he's in bad shape. I'm in. Well, I'm I'm okay, and the hovercraft is in bad shape. So we're doing the east wing. Face it south and north. Well, it's two different wings. Okay. Whatever direction they happen to be. <laughs> Whatever cardinal direction. Oh, this one's an easy guy to get rid of. Thanks, Double H. Okay, let's look. Okay, camera not being cooperative right now. It's almost like the camera is hindered by the actual walls of the room. That's that's kind of inconvenient. And uh, this apparently does nothing. Okay, exit only. Got it. Let's see here. Uh, any more pearls? Yeah, one pearl. I see that. Two pearls, but. They're in two. They're in two different ring, uh, wings. Yeah. And then I. There's no animals left. I think. Okay, I got all the animals in the slaughterhouse. Cool. So there's just two more pearls to get. One for each wing that I have left to explore. Ah, uh, here we go. We're splitting up. We'll follow each other in parallel. Good luck, Double H. You're probably gonna have an easier time of it than I am. Okay, that's obviously not the way. Oh gosh, what's going on here? Okay, I could hit that switch and then sneak by. I guess that's kind of the intent, but I'm going to be a little more bold about this. That and I see no one else around here, so if it's just him, well, it's kind of a no-brainer what we should do. I have given you wings, soldier. Oh wow! It almost smashed me on my head. <laughs> it. Materia. Yep, material crystals. But speaking of K-bubs, I've actually read something interesting about that uh, online. It uh, K-bubs, they're actually a food source, but people are like, "What are they made of? Are they like made out of people or something like soil like green?" But no, actually, it's they're made out of cows from. From what I've been gathering, they're made of, they're like, circular, sphere-like cow food. Or food made from cows, so. Yeah, they're like meatballs. <laughs> Pink meatballs. Interesting. Yeah. So where's Double H, because I've heard of them. Uh, he's, I don't know where he is, but he's probably somewhere nearby where he can't, where he can't uh, get to me and I can't get to him. Uh, let's see here. Can't go there. I think my objective is all the way past these these little capsules here. Okay, there's two of them. Awesome. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. I'm trying to figure out the best way to go about this. Okay, so he's gonna go. So I'm gonna go. Maybe. No. Oh, jeez. Yep. <laughs> Ah, now I just gotta wait some more. You know, I think this wing actually has the harder sneaking sections. The other one, the other one I don't think has as, as hard setups here, so I'm gonna... Oh, jeez. Oh, come on! Okay. 
Patience is the key. I'm already at 10 deaths. We don't want 11 now. I've been doing actually really darn good for avoiding that 11th death, so let's let's not ruin this good victory of mine. Oh, jeez. Okay, where's the other guy? I don't even see him. Well, obviously, I can't move when he's facing that way. Okay, there he is. Oh, this is going to work out. Okay, so he's going to turn off to the left, and that guy at the door... Okay, I'm going. Let's not touch the guys. Woo! We're out. Were you stressing there, honey? Just a little. Just a little, yeah. It can be pretty stressful. What's over here? Apparently nothing I can do for sneaking, because she's walking normally. That's always a good sign. Jade, for some reason, automatically knows when to start sneaking. And even if she's not even within view of any soldiers nearby, or alpha sections, it's like she's like, she knows. i got to start sneaking at this point. So the fact that she's walking normally, I'm okay. I can do whatever I want right now. And this was a nice little micro-puzzle. You would take the fuse, but then you'd never be able to get up unless you push that blo uh, that crate onto the elevator. Simple, but effective puzzle. Alright, where am I? What do I... I want to go... Where's the nearest reader? Because we're coming up on my time here, and I want to save... Okay, it looks like the reader is right past those blue bars. And so that means I need to... Okay. There's a fuse, but I'm not going that way right now because I want to save. I'm getting up on my time here. Uh, looks like another sneaking section. Gosh darn it. Oh! Oh, I remember this one, honey. This is, uh, this one I've never formally, I've never formally completed the sneaking section successfully. Why you always died? I've never figured it out, so I'm going to take the time and try and figure this out, so. I've all, I've just kind of ran and killed them or whatnot, so I think this is the first step. Um, okay, he just walks in a circle, and the other guy just goes back and forth, back and forth. So he's facing the other way. Now would not be the time to go. I think I actually have to go around the perimeter of the room here. That's what it looks like it, it's wanting me to do. I'm just waiting for the guy to turn. Okay, let's go. So we're gonna we're gonna trail this guy. As long as I'm ducking, I'm safe behind here until the guy goes back around again for another loop. Okay, so this guy's got to turn. Okay. I don't think I have enough time... Well... <laughs> Woo. Hey, Pearl! And the reader! Yay! Wow. Awesome. Um, before we uh, end this video, I'm going to kick these... Uh-oh. You know what? That was a bad idea. Uh, let's hide. 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 Okay, so hitting those attracts their attention. <laughs> Please go away. Please go away. Where is he? Oh, jeez. Oh, my goodness. Ah! Okay. Run, run, run. Oh. Run, 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 run. Ah, there's more of them! Ah! Get away! Get away. Oh, my goodness, there's three. Oh, my goodness, there's three. Oh, goodness. Ah, I can't go that way. Run, Jade, run! Run, run, run! Whew. Okay. You know what? Forget that. I'm just gonna call it here. This has been pretty crazy, so... See you later. <laughs> Bye.